Hi there, thank you for stopping by at my channel. Today's video is about a very beautiful croton plant which is called Sunny Star Croton. This plant has like a green and yellow leaves you can see in the video and its leaves are longer in style not the oval or round. So this is a very beautiful plant. Today I am going to transplant it in a bigger pot because it came uh, in a small pot when I bought it so it needs a bigger plant bigger pot so I'm going to transfer it to a six inch square uh, pot uh, so that it can grow well this plant needs well drained soil and uh, it, you, sh you can uh, water it when it need don't over water it don't like the over watering Otherwise, it leaves may start crisping and they will eventually die. You can prune it as your desired shape and uh, it will grow again. Uh, Croton is uh, susceptible to mealybugs and spider mites. So for its uh, solution, you can use uh, neem oil spray uh, like uh, two, three weeks in once two, three weeks so that uh, no uh, pest attack on it. When transplanted or move uh, its location, it may go under stress and may drop the leaf, but it will recover again. Don't worry. You can propagate it from its leaf and from its cutting, and uh, it thrives in zone 9 to 11, and in northern area below zone 9, it needs some protection, or you can bring it indoor uh, during the winter time and then put outside when the next spring comes. Uh, this thrives uh, in very uh, like 60 to 80 degree Fahrenheit temperature. If the temperature is above 80 degree or it's more heat then you can cover it or put under some shades. So you can see the roots are very fibrous. I'm going to put in this pot now so that roots can grow more and the plant will become a bigger plant. Normally its size goes from 10 to uh, like 4 to 10 feet when it is uh, grown outdoor in the soil but indoor it doesn't grow so tall and uh, it never uh, gives the flower indoor so sometime maybe but outdoor it gives gives the flower also. So it is very a uh, good plant for keeping indoor because, because it uh, is a uh, air purifier. It, uh, it converts the carbon dioxide to oxygen in the night time. So it is a very good plant to keep indoor. Leaves may be crispy when you see the leaves are crispy it means you are doing the over watering or very low watering so you just you should you should check the, your watering uh, schedule. Uh, I, actually this plant is a good addition to your indoor house plants so keep it indoor if you like. Thank you guys see you in my next video till then bye.